Slavers. They're holed up in the memorial. Mm, are you sure? In a moment, we'll charge them. We will have liberty, or we will have death. Join with us to defeat evil. Uh, you're going to let a bunch of slavers scare you, attack them. Slavers are too tough, you haven't got a chance. You, yeah, wait here, let me investigate first. They look heavily fortified. They knew we were coming. I'm afraid our only choice is to drive them out. Right, but let me go do a little bit of reconnoitering and see if I can thin them out a bit. If you don't do it, we will. I will do it. You're... Those slavers are still in control of the memorial. I, but I haven't left yet. Is it time for us? No. Stay here. Don't be too... Jesus. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on Tale of Two Wastelands Overhaul with the Capital Punishment Mod List. I am the Bearded OG, and we are back here in the mall here in D.C., and we're supposed to be meeting Hannibal um, at the Lincoln Memorial so that they can restore it and, I guess, move back in there. So I did... Two or three episodes ago, clear all of the slavers out of that place. But I suspect that this may be a script. Uh, that's a brotherhood. A scripted event, and there's probably going to be more slavers there that we're going to have to take out to finish out this quest. Or maybe not. You know, maybe it'll just stay clear, and we just got to meet him there, and everything will be hunky dory. But I am not counting on that. Oh, shite. More dogs. Uh, no. Okay. So the dogs have repopped. Okay, we still have a caution. All right, I think we're good now. All right, let's just get a glass on here and see if there's any movement. Okay, I don't see any of the bad bads back. All right, let's look at the... Meet Hannibal at the memorial. Oh, okay. We're supposed to meet him back over that way. Actually, you know what? That's a good thing. That'll give us a chance to come back up here and clear any bads out. But it doesn't look to me like they've repopped. It could be that this uh, that this area doesn't repop because of it's related to the quest. I'm thinking that's probably the case there. All right, let's go talk to him. So we might be able to pull this off without another fight. Is it possible that he hasn't made it here yet? Because I used the, the fast travel option. All right, let's look at the... Let's look at the map. He would have come all the way from Temple of the Union... Yeah, I'm I'm going to say he just hasn't made it here yet. So, I guess we'll just hang out and wait for him. We are good on food and water and sleep, so we can wait for a bit. So, yeah, I guess I'll just hang out here. We've we've already been down in there and there's nothing down there, so Okay, let's wait. Slavers! They're holed up in the memorial. Mm, are you sure? In a moment, we'll charge them. 
We will have liberty, or we will have death. Join with us to defeat evil. Uh, you're going to let a bunch of slavers scare you, attack them. The slavers are too tough, you haven't got a chance. You, yeah, wait here, let me investigate first. They look heavily fortified. They knew we were coming. I'm afraid our only choice is to drive them out. Right, but let me go do a little bit of reconnoitering and see if I can thin them out a bit. If you don't do it, we will. I will do it. You're... Those slavers are still in control of the memorial. I, but I haven't left yet. Is it time for us? No. Stay here. Don't be too... Jesus. Okay. <laughs> I don't see any slavers. Uh... Okay. Perhaps... Perhaps this quest doesn't have an alternate scenario if the player clears the slavers out first. Or maybe they just spawn in once Hannibal and group get here. Okay, well, let's go back and tell them to advance and just be ready for bad bads to spawn in. Thanks to you, we are able to make this journey. We will rebuild the great memorial to Lincoln and give hope. Okay, uh, wait here and you just got, I already did scout ahead. Well, let's go. Let's go. Uh, let's go. Are you guys following me? Uh-oh. Did something get broken? What is it? Wait right here and you... I'll give you six hours. Hey! Okay. Thank now... What is it? Okay, it's safe. Finally. Thanks for the picture. It's given me a lot to do. You're welcome, bud. Okay, it's safe. Go ahead. Move out. Let's go. Oh. Is that mine? I think so. <laughs> That's probably a good thing I picked that up. <laughs> That'd be oh shit. That'd be terrible. Terrible if they walked over my frag mine. Um, you can go now. What is it? D uh, yeah, something's not working right. Obviously, we've got to get those slavers. I'm sure. Okay. Goddamn slavers have the memorial. As soon as Hannibal gives the word. What are we going to do? Those slavers have captured the memorial. Please, sir, help us get rid of all those slavers in the memorial. I'm working on it. You have a weapon, right? Yeah, he does. Okay. I don't know what to do. Uh, What is it? I'll give you six hours. Okay. And then... What is it? It's safe. Finally. Thank you for all your help. You're welcome. Now go over there. <sighs> I might have to reload and just let them do the initial charge. Okay, he's back. Um, let's go here and... No, not there. Drink all of our water and eat this Mirelurk special. Because we waited, I waited like 22 hours this time. And then I saved after I finished waiting, so. Slavers, they're holed up in the memorial. Yes, they are. In a moment, we'll charge them. Okay. We will have liberty or we will have death. Join with us to defeat evil. I will. You're going to let a bunch of slavers scare you? Attack them. You're right. They are all cowards at heart. Okay, they're they're actually moving. What? Oh. I forgot something. <laughs> all right, reload. <laughs> okay, I need to try and get around Hannibal really quick so I can pick up this frag mine. Okay, now we can talk to him. Slavers, they're hold in a Okay, here we go. I hope you succeed, stranger. I can't wait to set up a school for free slaves. Alright, I just wonder if they're gonna repop or not. 
I think these guys would get absolutely annihilated if I hadn't have taken them out first. I mean, because most of these guys don't even have armor on. Oh, look! The place is clear! What do you know? Good to see you. It's good to see you, too. What do you need? Uh... Okay. May the spirit of the great Lincoln protect you. So, okay, how when uh Oh, there are some slavers over there. Okay. Paradise Falls infamy gained. Completed kill all the slavers near Lincoln Memorial. Okay. Crossbow? Oh, that's cool. We'll, uh, we'll pick up that assault rifle for now. We might end up ditching it. I wonder if those guys have been here all along and I just never, you know, they were padding over here and we never saw them. Well, they're all gone now. We made it. The memorial is really ours. I cannot thank you enough. Hey, I'm just glad we got rid of some scum of the earth slavers. And that you're going to fix the Lincoln Memorial. Here, take this. It's a token of our thanks. Uh, what do you got? Dark gun schematic. Okay. <laughs> nice. We've gained karma. Um... All right, very good. Here's what I'm going to do about Lincoln's rifle. I'm going to see if they do, if you know, if they put some of this other memorabilia on display. And if they do, I'll bring them all the other stuff and I'll probably, I mean, we don't need Lincoln's rifle. It's kind of cool, but if they're going to put it on display, then we'll give it to Whatever. them. Whatever. It'll mean, uh, dude, this is not the time to get rude with me. Uh, <laughs> uh so we have we achieved so much. head of state and we've the memorial leveled. will be a beacon for slaves everywhere. Are you talking to that dog? Did four score do lots of work here? All right. Thanks to you, we're rebuilding the memorial. That's awesome. Okay. Everyone is grateful for what you've done for us. I'll just Thanks pick that you. stuff up. I'll get to do it. For now, I suppose, since we can still You're carry a hero it. To everyone here, ma'am. Well, thanks. Did you just call me ma'am, though? You've come to the see us. The slavers will have some How goddamn sweet. respect for now, huh? It's great to see you again. That's about time you were nice to me, Simone. Okay. That is it, ladies and gentlemen, for head of state. Let's go back home. We'll come back and visit these guys later and see if they've, you know, if they've restored Lincoln's head and, you know, done all the stuff. See how they're doing. Make sure... New super mutants haven't come in to uh, cause them trouble. So, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll go home, we'll sleep, and then we're going to head west. Our destination will be our next bounty, but we'll also just kind of see what there is to see along the way. So I will meet you guys when we're on our way out west. Unless something significant happens. Well, no, actually, take that back. I'll meet you after we sleep for the leveling, and then we'll head out west. All right, guys, we're back at the base. I uh, wanted to show you something here. Uh, our caravan radio has a mod for our sniper rifle. It's the sniper rifle carbon fiber parts, which decreases the weight of our rifle by five pounds, which is pretty good. And um don't think there was anything else um, in terms of mods that uh, I'm interested in. Uh, I haven't forgotten about, you know, all this other stuff to fix up the house more. We, we will do that, but 
I mean, we got lots of caps. We got plenty of caps to do business and do what we need, but I wouldn't say we have an excess of them quite yet. Okay, so let's purchase that. And right now we're, our weight is at 221. So if we go to here and put this mod on, our weight's now at 213. It's a beautiful thing. Um, that, that reduced our weight by eight pounds. Huh. There must be some other kind of bonus happening there. Yeah, because we were at 221 and now we're at 213, so that's 8 pounds. Okay, I'm not complaining. It just doesn't make much sense. Also, for anybody who might be interested, this is what the crossbow uh, looks like. I'm not going to use it, though, because it, um, it, only, it only does 40 damage per shot. So just about every other weapon we're carrying does quite a bit more than that. Um, it's a little bit unstable. It's not terribly unstable. So, yeah, kind of a fun weapon, but again, there's not really much point in us using it when what we have is better. But we will keep it because, you know, it's kind of a, a specialty weapon. And we will put that in our specialty weapon uh, locker there. And the crossbow bolts we will put in the specialty ammo. There we go. Okay, cool. All right, we are ready to sleep and level. Let's do it. I just want to sleep until the next morning so we have daylight. Fantastic. Okay, so we are still working on guns and explosives. We will continue to work on guns and explosives until I get them uh, either maxed out or very close to maxed out. So let's get guns up to 60 and explosives up to 49. Very good. All right, let me look through these again and decide what I want. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is go with Life Giver. This basically gives us uh, 30 hit points per rank and we can uh, have up to three ranks. So uh, having more life pool doesn't suck. That's what we're going to do. Very good. Okay, we should be ready to go. I've done all my my vendoring and my repairing and my... I, actually, we do need to eat and drink because we slept for a while. So let's just grab... Hmm, maybe six waters or five waters is fine. And let's grab ant bits because ant bits do not give us any rads at all. I had the doctor fix me up. We'll eat these first because they do. Oh, I guess we're not that hungry and thirsty after all. Okay, so let's just have one drink. And yeah, that should be good. All right, I'm going to put um, those back. And let's put two of those back. We'll take two with us for the road. And we have our MREs for emergency eating out in the field. Let's take a look at our map here. Actually, let's go to quests and we'll select our regulator contract because that's kind of our main goal. But we're going to head out west, almost as far west as we can go. And we're going to also cross these areas. Yeah, okay. Let's do it. The Rad Scorpion Poison Clan, and we have a bot up here. Let's put the pulse slugs in. Energy cells and scrap metal. Nice. All right, I hear gunfire. We have a downed bot. The question is, what killed the bot? So 
Watch out for landmines. Uh, okay, we have a caution. Let's grab all of this. And we have a danger edge, so I don't know where it's coming from. Oh, it's a scorp. Okay. Not gonna take the meat. I did look into that, by the way. I can make a recipe with rad scorpion meat, but it does it's not that great. Okay, I'll take the bandages. I think we'll leave the nails. Let's get up in here. What's the uh, VW on a blood draw kit? Wait, that doesn't even show up here. Oh, that's because it's, excuse me, it's an aid item. Oh, 150? All right. I have been looting the, those. I was just thinking to myself, eh, I ain't going to grab that. But yes, we will grab those. That's a stellar VW. All right, let's keep going this way. We have a mole hole over here. Let's go discover that. And then it looks like there's some kind of community or something over here. Okay. Jury Street Metro. I think I actually came by here. Let's just pop down inside of here real quick. I think I came by here when we came back from getting the pressure valves from that substation. All right, let's put... Uh, Going that way. See what looks like a reloading station there. Uh, okay, we got raiders. I keep looting those cherry bombs in order to make bottle cap mines, but I loot so many frag mines in this game that I've never had to make a bottle cap mine. Uh, we'll take that and that. Hammers and lawnmower blades. Weapon repair kit. Yes, indeed. We'll take that. Guess we can take surgical tubing. Speaking of which, Dean's Electronics, that's repair. Fantastic. Okay. What is our repair up to now? It's up to 62 plus 5 because of our armor. So it's getting up there. Our guns is effectively up to 78. 
I like it. Okay, so that's... I don't know where that goes. Do we have one of those... Um, whatchamacallit thingies that show us the different metro lines? Good loot in here. That thing's probably heavy as all get out. It's in very good condition though. Let's just look at its VW. It's got a 40 VW, but even so. It's only half a pound. All right. We'll take it then. Take the water. All right. Um before we go Trapes and way down here. I want to see where it goes because I'm not really interested in going south. I want to go west. There's usually um, a little guide thingamadoodle that shows you the, the metro lines. Maybe it's back outside here. All right, I don't, I don't see it. Um. And that, the sign down below said it was it was going south anyway, so we don't want to go south. So I guess we'll just not do that for now, and we'll keep looking around here. Oh, shit. I think those guys are talents. Over here. God damn it. Item aid antiseptic bandit. Ultra Stim, Blood Pack, Hydra. All right, you fuckers are dead now. Brotherhood? No, you know what? I think those guys are Enclave. Okay. Um. Seemed like these guys were a little harder to kill this time. That armor's in really good shape. It's going to be super heavy, though. I'm not going to take the laser rifle. Twelve gauge. I'm gonna take the sod off or the mute fruit. An X. Ooh, what is that? That looks like a new sniper rifle, ladies and gentlemen. Uh. 
An XL70. It's a five millimeter weapon. Is it a... Okay, so it's an automatic. It's got decent DPS, but nothing like our 45 auto. Okay, I'll hang on to it because, you know, it's a, a pretty unique weapon. Probably won't use it, though. Because it's not really better than what we already have. All right. What do we got here? Hank's electrical supply. Come on, boy. Oh, shit. Hey, those either Brotherhood or Enclave guys are coming back. I don't think the Enclave is hostile outright. I think they're neutral, but I could be wrong about that. I just don't remember. Tell you what, though, man, if those raiders hop out that door, these guys are going to go to town on them, probably. Uh, yeah, those guys might just be Brotherhood. Let's go see. Oh, yeah. Here's some of the local wildlife. He's Brotherhood. Okay. Maybe we could actually lure these guys out and have the Brotherhood guy take them out. <laughs> Is he going to go after him? Dude, are you going to do anything? They must have gone back inside again. Yeah. Alright, I guess they're not going to play. You're not going to play ball. Shit. Come on, boy. Kick ass. Wow, we took a pounding. Shut up. Ah, all right, fuck. Um, take one of those, one of those, one of those. We need, uh, oh, okay. We don't have any problems with our limbs except for our head. And I don't have a doctor's bag left. That's not good. <clears throat> hey. We got some scrap electronics, though, so there you go. Through eight rounds. <clears throat> a mercenary's machine gun. Oh, that's a big machine gun. Serious rate of fire, too. No wonder we took so much damage. Oh! 1186 DPS? Are you fucking kidding me? O-M-G. 
Very expensive to fire, though. <laughs> it's some major firepower. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. I think we'll be hanging on to this. Goodness gracious. Takes a million years to reload it, though, but that's to be expected. I mean, it's got 90 rounds in the magazine. Well, that was worth the price of admission. Okay. Uh, another 45 auto machine gun, too, like the one we currently have. Uh, that stuff's going to be too heavy. Weapon repair kit. Look at all the scrap electronics in here. Oh, my God. This is amazing. Uh, no. I wanted the wrench. There we go. And... Yeah, we'll take the Nuka-Cola. 32 pistol, 32 rounds. Twelve gauge. I think we'll leave the turpentine because it's kind of heavy. Oh man, this is gonna suck. The scrap electron. Oh man, this is just great. No doctor's bag, unfortunately. Blamco mac and cheese. Duct tape, nine mil rounds. We're going to probably, um, can't, uh, there we go. Holy crap, there's so much stuff in here. Yeah, we're down a couple of lockpicking skills just because of our uh, issues with our head. Okay, we could counter that with some Mintats, I think. And let's also take the... Preserved blood pack. Mintats will give us two intellect. Is that enough to open it? No, it isn't. All right, then the other thing we could do is... I'm going to get ourselves addicted here. I think... Yeah, this Medex Surret will ignore negative effects... 10% limb, less limb damage and restored health. Fixer, temporary addiction removal. Well, okay, hold on a sec. Let's actually look at our concussion. Endurance, hydro withdrawal. Okay, it's probably our concussion that's causing the our thing. So, hmm. if we okay, yeah, let's try this medic surret. That's still not. Oh God, that's still not allowed us open. I mean, I, I guess we'll just have to come back. Because we're kind of in bad shape right now. All right. We're 14 pounds overweight. What I think I'm going to do is use this to repair our current one just to light. Oh, no, it's not even going to let me do that. Okay. Here, get rid of that. That'll help a little bit. All right, we've got all this Talon armor. 
Okay, so which one of these is... It's got the lowest VW. That one does. Okay. That one's got a pretty low VW, too. Let's ditch both of those. Okay, now we can actually move. Um... Right. Okay, here's what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to go back home because uh, we got that. Uh, we got the mole hill. And I'm going to go see the dock and get all fixed up. And I, this weapon is just incredible in terms of how much damage it does. I mean, I thought our 45 was badass, and it is badass. 405 DPS, but this thing... 1186 DPS. The th it's going to be so expensive to fire, though. Oh, my God. All right. Well, I want to see if I can make it work. We, we, we probably won't use it for, you know, normal combat, only when we're jumped by these assholes or, you know, when, when we really need it. But, man, when we really need it, this thing's going to just annihilate the enemies. So I will meet you guys back here after I get all fixed up, and then we'll proceed. All right, guys, we are back. Uh, I'm all fixed up. I got this machine gun all fixed up and modded. I ha happen to have all three mods that it uses. Um, the DPS is actually down to 789, so it must have been some of the meds or something I was on that <laughs> had it up to over 1,100. But still, I mean, 789 DPS is crazy. Um, and so, uh, you know what, that's, that's supposed to have eight strength. Um, let's see, we only have seven strength. Yeah, when we level again, we might need to take that extra attribute point then, uh, because that's going to cause us some trouble. Yeah, it's, it's a bit wavy. And I think it's because of the fact that we don't have enough strength for it. But I think we'll more than make up for it, in, you know, for the time being with just the crazy, crazy firepower that it has. Uh, and I went and made as many 308s as I, I had stuff to, and we, we got to really prioritize... Yeah, purchasing 308s. Uh, I have 870 rounds, but with this weapon, uh, those won't last real long. So we're going to really be using our snake lore a lot for normal kills. And, um, and of course, you know, we still have our, our shotgun and our sniper rifle, too. All right, let's go back in here. And I want to see if I can open. I should be able to open that safe now. Okay. Take those. That, that, and those. I'm not going to take the shotgun. Okay. Um, no, I don't have enough hacking skill for that. Okay, wow. It hurt like a son of a bitch to come in here, but... Turned out to be quite profitable. Now, we also have some places over here. Why do I get the feeling like there's probably going to be raider? Uh, I guess that's a robot. Raiders in here, too. Gold ribbon grocers. Okay. Let's get this ready, uh, just in case. And let's see what happens when we go in here. Stupid human, shut up now. You come with us now. Super mutants. Out of the frying pan. Now see here, you hulking horrors. This young lady has been through quite enough for one day. Holster your weapons or... Okay, there's arrows. Okay, I'm turning that off. I've explained this before, but the reason I turn the radio off is because sometimes it'll play copyrighted music. 
got oh wow there's probably traps all over here and that, i'm guessing that's why we have arrows to tell us where to go maybe i don't know Yep, there's gas over that way, so we don't want to fire from there. I'm not seeing... I mean, there's a one Nuka-Cola bottle down there, but... Oh, there's a grenade bouquet right there. Why do I get the feeling that, like, I'm going to get the shit kicked out of me in this place? Okay, um, oh, look at all this stuff lined up on the shelf. Uh, it's almost like it wants me to step on that. Should we should we play along? Okay. Oh, <laughs> okay, that thing came down. Oh, and it did knock all these down. Well, did it knock all it didn't knock all of them down. That's funny. Okay. Uh flower. Take the scrap metal. More gas, so we, so we don't want to shoot the weapon. We don't want to start the oven either, because that could let the gas go off. Shit ton of milk bottles. Oh, there's a baseball pitching machine trap. All right. Uh, let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> I don't like that place. Says I'm not strong enough to sprint with the weapon, but I still can. So I don't know what's up with that. Okay, so, um, it's Brotherhood over there. There were a couple of houses over here. Let's just kind of go scope them out real quick before we continue on. Because although we are Working our way towards our next bounty. We're also kind of just in free exploration mode at the moment. I heard an explosion over that way. Great. Here's some of the local wildlife. Yeah. Whatever you say. Fixing things. Is that uh, a permanent? No, it's just a repair. Drainage chamber. Didn't we see a drainage chamber option somewhere else? That's very likely another World of Pain POI.
Sometimes these ruined homes have like cabinets or safes and things to loot. Not seeing anything though. You've dis uh, discovered cul-de-sac house. Okay. Except for I can't get inside a cul-de-sac house. Oh, looks like we can get inside this one here. Also, is there anything significant up here? Got some mute fruit. An open refrigerator. Just kind of looking around the back here. All right, let's go see what's inside of the cul-de-sac house. All righty. Dandy boy apples. There's blood on the floor. Ball caps. So far, not a whole lot in here. First book of farming. No. Lunchbox. Darts and cherry bombs. We'll take those. Couple of Mad X thingies. Vodka and whiskey. And a safe with nothing in it. I'm missing something. Pretty boring, useless house. Okay. Whatevs, man. Okay, let's take a look at the map. And uh, we got this Fort Bannister. We'll take a quick look at that and as we continue to work our way towards Makeshift Shack. I don't think I want to go down in there. I have a feeling like if we do that, that's going to take a long time. Maybe some other time.
Uh, okay, we got scorpions. Big scorpion. All right, let's let this Open fire. brotherhood help us out here. All right, you know what? You got the power armor. You got that. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's radiation there. Whatever. Whatever that's all about. Uh. Can we get up here? That scorpion's coming back for us. I'm trying to there we go. Let's see if we can get up here. Alright, while we're up here, let's just take a look, see. It just looks like a ruined building. And more ruined buildings. A crashed train that way. This fort is... Right over that way. Is that... Oh, shit, there's a Yagwai. Uh, where did I see him? Um, the fort's like supposed to be right over there. Oh, maybe it's, uh, it's probably further out that way where all those sandbags are. Okay. Um, I'm just looking to see if I could spot where that Yelgwai it went. It's right down there somewhere. I don't know where he is. Okay. But since we know he's down that way, let's go around that way. Even though there's probably another Yagwai around that way. Starting to get dark, so we'll put on our night vision here pretty soon. <clears throat> what is that thing flashing over there? It's a uh, feral dog. Correction, it was a feral dog. That's better. Oh shit. A couple of craters. And a dog. Okay, we need to stay away from those craters.
Because I just fixed my radiation. I don't want more. Alright, this is part of this fort. Yep. We are at Fort Bannister, whatever Fort Bannister actually is. Okay, when you're approaching a military fort, you should probably assume that there's going to be landmines surrounding it. Yes, indeed. Take one of those, take a couple of those, grab a splint, and fix up our fucked up arm. Jeez. Hello? Ooh. Who's there? I guess it was nothing. I need a I need a landmine detector. Let's grab, uh... Oh, there's a guy right there. Hello? Sh shit. Who's there? Okay, he's got a, uh... Aha. He's got a there melee weapon. Are. Nice. Okay. Another one. Is that a talon? That is a talon. I guess it was nothing. Is this their fort? Oh, we could bring our missiles out here and just obliterate the place. I'm not taking his armor. There's no way we're gonna be able to carry it if we're gonna kill a bunch of them here. This could be our chance to get revenge on these motherfuckers. Watch out for landmines, OG. Uh, is that a head? Yep, that's a head right there. Retreat! Fucking retreat! Damn straight, you better retreat. I put the hurt on him pretty good. Yeah, I I like the idea of bringing some retribution on the Talon Company mercs. Those fuckers deserve it. Nobody here anymore. Nope. Even though your head is like severely damaged, there's nobody here anymore. I could, of course, use my louder weapons, but Who's there? we might need to stay quiet for a bit here. As we watch out for landmines. Okay, there's a dude over that way. I saw a couple of them patrolling back down there, too. We might be further ahead to get a little, yeah, right there, to get a little further away and try and snipe, snipe them down. Is it just, no, there's two of them out there. Thing is, if I fire from here though, I'm probably going to get the attention of those dudes. We have some cover right here though. All right, let's try it. I don't know why that dog keeps running back and forth. Okay, we got his attention. Well, that's a super mutant. What the hell's up with that dog? Okay, let's get out the big gun. Ah. 
Throw it, please. Oh, <laughs> the fire rate on this thing is amazing. All right, here. I need to get back under cover here. All right, so we took a talon out down there. There's another one way over here. And there's one right over there, too. Okay, where is this guy? He's right there. That is a long shot. <laughs> yeah, baby! Okay. Okay, let's, uh... I'm sorry about all that recent unpleasantness. Okay, let's... Let's scooch down and go loot these kills. And then we might... Where are you? Alright, you wanna... Get some pulse You'll slugs? Find that my electronic sensors are quite sophisticated. You'll find that my pulse slugs are qu quite sophisticated, too. I'll take that, that, and that. Okay, that's a super. It's really bright down here. Oh, god damn it. I hate that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, stats, status, of, uh, condition. Okay, what I was saying is let's go loot the kills that we did out here and see if we can find... Uh, it looks like there might be a cliff over on that other end of the compound where we can just lay down and snipe the fuck out of these guys. Well, that's worthless. Um, I think I'm going to leave that. Marine service rifle. Okay, so we killed two supers and we killed a couple of Talon down here somewhere too. It, it is like really bright out. Well, no, it's not that bright out. Hmm. Not exactly sure where the the first Merc we killed was. Thought it was like right over in this area. Not sure if it would have been this far out. See, we were up on that corner. Yeah, I'm not... Uh, that's the super mutant. I'm not spotting the... Oh, here it is. Good, okay. Okay, right away, we'll take that. Uh, we'll take your fingers and your cases. I'm going to pick this pistol up and take the mod off of it, whatever it happens to be. Okay. And then we'll ditch the pistol.
And then we killed another one way off this way. I don't want to get too close to their compound there. Hmm. I don't remember exactly where we shot him, but I want to say it was probably right around in that area, maybe? Let's top our health off, too. What kind of food do I have? Uh, steamed rad roach. Oh, no. That's rad roach. I was thinking Meyer alert for a minute there. Okay, let's just do a bandage and these two expired stim packs. Probably more than enough, but that's okay. That's the problem with shooting too many of them before you go after them, because then you kind of forget where they all are. At least I do. There's something moving around up there. I think it's a Protectron. Speaking of which, let's get normal slugs back in here in case we run into a Yagwai or something. Okay. So I think that other Merc we, uh, we killed was right up around in here. Because we were way down there in that corner. But it's very difficult to spot. Oh, there I think that's him right there. That's the dog we killed too. Yep, that's him. Okay. We have a caution. Take that, 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 and those. Let's do a quick save, and I think we're going to maybe see if we can get up on that cliff there and work these fuckers over. Oh, let's get pull slugs back in for this bot up here. You know what would be fun, though, is there's a, a mantis to come back here with my missile launchers and just nuke the fuck out of this place. We may still do that, because even if we do take them all out now, they'll re-pop, I'm sure. Okay, this... Oh, that's a Brahmin. Scrap electronics, baby. Is that a mailbox? It's a mailbox right there. Nothing in it, though. Okay, let's climb up on this cliff here. Why? All right, we're going to use this because we're pretty close to him. Nice. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, I guess we'll grab the meat. Okay. This is a nice little sniping spot up here. Just want to make sure there's no other enemies around first. All right, let's get, let's get down here amongst these rocks, maybe right up here. Okay. There we go. That guy's got a flamethrower, it looks like. He's going to be kind of hard to hit from that far away with him moving. All right, got the job done. Okay, let's look for more movement. We'll teach the uh, Telon mercenary company to be coming after us. It's nothing personal, it's just business. Yeah, well, it's personal. Especially as many times as you assholes have attacked me. We killed those that guy already. Not really seeing anybody else down there. That doesn't mean they're not there. Okay, let's uh, move over this way. Get a little closer. Okay, well, I think that, uh, what the fuck is that thing? It's like a big scarecrow or something. <sighs> Should we go down there? <laughs> there could be a whole bunch more dudes down there. What time is it? It's 5 a.m. We can scooch down this way without breaking our legs. Last time we had a big fall, we didn't just break our legs. We absolutely pulverized them. Do a quick save here. You wouldn't think they'd have landmines inside their base.
All right, let's get this back out and just take another quick peek looking for movement. Uh, thought maybe I saw something moving down there, but I'm not sure. Okay, let's advance. You've discovered Fort Bannister. Okay, we'll take the fuel, that, the grenades, the finger, and the drained tanks. Something's moving around over there. Uh, we cannot get into that weapons box. Okay, let's move over to this next spot. We're going to have to take off our night vision here in a moment. Oh, look at that. All right, they've got an underground spot. Another sniper. Beautiful. Take those and those. All right, let's take these off. Three oh eight, that's what we want. Yeah, the guy who was up here must have been one of the guys that ran out and came after us. That would be my guess. There's also a place to go inside over that way. Okay, let's move around over this way. That's what I keep seeing running around as a wild dog. I did see two guys patrolling out here. I have not forgotten about them. So we got to just kind of be mindful of that. But what I want to do is I want to kind of go around the entire perimeter of the fort before we um, do anything else. Doesn't appear to be anybody over here. That looks like a missile silo.
there's a dog over that way. What is that? That looks like a gun clipping through the tent. Pretty sure that's what I saw. Okay. What we're going to do then is... We're hidden. All right, we'll take that. All of that. That armor is in pretty good shape. I think I'm going to grab it for the moment, but if we have to ditch it, we have to ditch it. Sewer entrance to commanding officer's quarters. Okay. Let's dispatch this dog before we do anything else. That's the main fort. Um, is this a, I wonder, if, is this a vanilla place or is this a World of Pain place? I don't know. I think the Talon Company is in vanilla. That doesn't necessarily mean they have a headquarters, though. This could get crazy. Let's get the big boy out. Nobody in here. Reloading bench. Take that whiskey. It's toy cars. Okay.
Nothing in there. Shotgun rounds, nice. And a combat shotgun. Yeah, it's going to be kind of heavy. Let's just take a look at its VW. It's not the best. Um, okay, hold on a sec. That sniper rifle does 60 damage per shot. DPS doesn't matter so much with a sniper rifle. That one does 46, but with 99 DPS? I guess it's got a faster reload. Hmm, I don't know. This isn't really worth much, though, and we can't... Doesn't have any mods on it. We can't use it to repair our current sniper rifle. So I think we're gonna I think we're gonna ditch that. This has a VW of 15. So I guess we'll hang on to it for the moment. Kind of hate to throw that out, but if it doesn't work that much, it isn't worth it. <gasps> Worth that much, excuse me. Oh, yeah, we'll take that for sure. Okay, so. Uh, we have pretty much, as far as I can tell, eliminated all of the Mercs on the outside of the fort. The question now is... Do I feel like we can go inside here and survive... In, the close, in close quarters? I don't know the answer to that question. Um, whilst I ponder that, I'd like to go take out the other two mercs that we saw padding out here. There's nothing down in there. If I can, if I can find him again. Thank God that didn't mess up our head. <sighs> okay, uh, antiseptic, bandage, two expired stim packs, a splint on the arm. Fucking landmines. Okay, so we started this whole fight kind of over at that corner, and I looked out that way to, and saw the two guys patrolling. So they probably, in fact, patrol and don't, you know, stay fairly close to the area. Got to totally watch the ground. Oh, is that going to be one of those irradiated craters? Yep, it is. Okay, don't go near that thing. Alright, I'm just trying to see if I can spot them. Yep, right there. Oh, what was that? That looked like a raider. I mean, we can kill them too. They deserve to die just as much as the Talon.
hell is that? Oh, it's a big blowfly. The raider over here probably took him out. Laszlo Radford. Uh. Uh oh. He doesn't have a finger. Hmm. He's got a railway rifle. Which is probably heavy as fuck. Oh man, did I just kill an innocent person? Or... Dude. Well, that sucks. I mean, I'm assuming he's innocent because... Bonus limb damage, bonus critical chance. So this is like a pneumatic thing, huh? <laughs> That's kind of funny. Um... Doesn't do very much damage per shot, though. And it's got a terrible VW. However, it is kind of a unique weapon, and it's the first one we've come across. So we might see if we can hang on to it. But damn it! Dude! Okay, well... Those kinds of accidents, I guess, happen in the wasteland. And that's the problem, you know. Oh, shit. 95% of the humans that you're going to run into out here are going to shoot you first and ask questions later. But it's that 5%... that you... Shoot when you didn't mean to, and I feel pretty damn bad about it. What can you do? All right. Let's move on, because there's nothing else we can do but move on. I could have sworn, though, that I saw two... Dudes patrolling, they looked like mercs. There's a rat scorpion in there. Yao Guai down there. Oh, there he is. Alright, we still have caution. There's some stuff down here. Looking for traps. Take the wrench. Uh, I don't want the thirty two rifle. But I will take the bullets and the duct tape. I can't... Okay, get the turpentine. I can't get... the psycho out of there. Okay, what if we... do this? There. Hmm. 
I mean, maybe that last little guy killed this guy. <laughs> There's no way we'll ever know. There's no way we'll ever know. I do feel bad about it, though, but, you know, what can you do? Can't justify it. All I can say is that most of the time, they'll shoot first, ask questions later. And he was in a dangerous area, and he looked like a raider from afar. It's still my fault, though. If I believed in God, I'd ask him to forgive me. But it's not God that needs to forgive me anyways. It's Lazlo's ghost. But I don't believe in that shit either, so... <laughs> All right, well, uh, what should we do? I want to go in there, man. I We could absolutely get our ass handed to us in there. But, oh, landmines. Watch out for landmines. Tell you what. We're going to go in. And if we get killed, I will reload before we... You know, wherever the last time I, I loaded, I've done a, I did a quick save not too long before we left the compound here. And that way we can have a premonition and redeem ourselves with Laszlo. If we get killed. If we don't get killed, then it is what it is. Okay. So. Let's do a save here. And head on into Fort Bannister. Because as I always like to say, what could possibly go wrong?